Hello and welcome to PWH Services. In our today's video, we will learn to draw a watch using our rotate tool which we learned in our previous classes. Uh, if you have not watched our previous videos, so kindly uh, visit our previous videos and see that how can we use the rotate tool. And today we will going to use this tool and will draw a very uh, beautiful watch. So without wasting any time, let's start doing it practically. Um, first of all, I will draw the main dial of the watch. So use ellipse tool, press shift and draw a circle. I am giving it a dark gray kind of color, more dark with like that line it according to your artwork so in Adobe Illustrator there is uh, rulers which will help you to work efficiently so there are rulers for now I am just doing it for the sake of because uh, I need to line it in the center as well Make sure that these rulers will be exactly in the center of uh, the circle. Okay, now uh, what will you do? Just simply lock everything, select and press Ctrl and 2. Now you can see that it's locked. The other way, is that that select everything and go to object there is lock and selection so now you cannot move now I have to mention hours which are 12 on our dial so we have learned a formula in our previous classes of rotate tool so just let's open calculator The overall circle has 360 degree and I need 12 tiles, 12 rounds. So let's see 360 divided by 12, so 30 degree. Okay, so I have to first let's, let's draw a circle which should exactly meet your center line. That's enough. Make it a color. I'm giving it a bright green kind of color. Let's make it a little more bigger. Yeah. Pick your tape tool at your center. Just zoom in as much as you can press all click and so we calculated that 30 degree and copy so now press the D, D. control D control D control D right one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven and twelve Uh, I'm just not happy with the bit that it is covering so just let's repeat everything it's now selected again repeat the process zoom in as much you can Thirty. copy Yes, now it's looking better. Now we need to uh, draw the lines which represents minutes. So 
the overall lines are 60 again calculate the angle 360 divided by 60 because I need 60 lines so 6 degree all right simply draw a rectangle make sure that it also will be at center and give it light green I think light gray sorry Again, pick your rotate tool at your center, press Alt and click. We calculate it 6 degree and copy. Repeat. Control D. I am pressing Control and D. right so you can see that our dial is uh, complete almost but you just have to remove these lines because we don't need them all right now I will draw needles for hour and minutes for now I'm grouping all this because you can move it everywhere now also I am going to hide rulers for now Alright guys, alright. We will draw needles now. more pixels right select it and with pen tool add the anchor point in the center to give it a pointable shape yeah that's enough now we need hours which would be a smaller than this all right yes circle and with a black color and align it in the center group it as well now uh, I'm giving it effect which uh, we have not learned but it's easy to utilize just go to stylize and drop shadow it's too much you just minimize it 55 mm, we don't need any shadow on x-axis just 
set it to 0 on y axis I am setting it to 3 blur is 3 as well to give it a much realistic kind of uh, again I need I need uh, guide so Guides are very important because uh, guides are very very important because you know whenever you use guides and uh, it will it will give you much more control to use the things as well. So for now it's very uh, messy kind of menu. Mm, let's just find that what we are going to do mm. where it is where it is rulers guides can show guides okay pick this and here just align size no worries just that's enough and just that center this needle should be much more smaller yeah that's enough now I need seconds uh, needle seconds needle will be much more thinner zoom in as much as you can one one I'm using shortcut keys which we have uh, already made video so you can watch that video to learn shortcut keys to work much faster giving it uh, orange kind of color Is this uh, I'm just ungrouping it I just want to bring it front right it should be here
Hmm. Give it shadow as well. Starlight, drop shadow. Okay. Now you can hide your guys. <coughs> All right. So our dial is ready. So simply unlock everything and group this. Now I need the external part of this watch. Make another dial. Just giving it dark color again it should be at center a rectangle Simply make a copy These are well aligned Now you can choose uh, shape builder tool and This is now one shape though. All right, so <coughs> Again choose uh, a rectangle Central line This is for the sake of uh, Cutting because we have to insert the buckle here Exactly do same thing here Alright, align it now again. Shape builder tool and simply minus it. Alright, now uh, select this corner. I'm pressing shift right now. So that you can select all these points and just make these shapes smoother. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Insert your dial here, you can arrange it and bring to front. Just size it accordingly. Alright, that's enough. Now our artwork is uh, not that much lengthy so you can do it long by pressing alt and just move it a bit <coughs> all right so we need to draw the buckle part Right, that's enough. So 
same thing right now you can see that our watch is now looks much more realistic right so just make it a bit lengthy and uh, one two three Remember I am using direct selection tool so again I am smoothing its shapes yeah that's enough What happened there? Yeah, anyways, just make copy. Make it the stroke, give it a light color. Press shift and uh, Align it here. So we have learned dash stroke. This should be of two points, dash lines. Is that enough? Yeah. What I need here, uh, four. That's enough. And the needle. What I will do. Uh, sorry. Uh, was not selected accordingly. Now you can do that. Right. Need to draw a needle. We can resize it accordingly. right a little bit lighter color again 
make a copy convert it to stroke like that here it is so you can see that this is our watch this is the watch we have uh, designed using the rotate tool and the formula we used for rotation was very simple and uh, you can also design as much as many things as you want with your creativity this is uh, this was only a simple watch for just for the sake of practice and that how you can use tools in your art so this was all about today have a nice day.